the power of rushing water. It's one of the most dangerous things there is because it's so hard to predict where it's going to go. OSU Fire Service training, along with the Oklahoma City Fire Department, has developed a top-tiered swift water training program using the controlled waters of the Riversport Rapids in downtown Oklahoma City to attract rescuers from around the globe to train in swift water, flood water rescue. Well, it's one of the most dangerous rescues we can perform as rescuers just because there's so many variables. Flood water kills more people than any other natural disaster in the U.S. Upstream, face upstream, swim, swim, swim. Good job, good job. First lesson, respect the water. It's just relentless power. And once it starts flowing, it's not going to stop flowing for a while. You're dealing with flooding in parks and streets. you got barbed wire fences, trees, all kinds of hazards that are holding people up where they can't continue down the river floodwaters they have and they're getting stuck and then they're drowning. Students at this school learn to read the water. Read the water. Well, what we do is watch the current. We watch the flow, we watch a pattern. It lets you know if something's under the water and if it's a straight or if it's turned, if you're able to navigate it or if something's under the water that could possibly catch a victim. Flood waters are dangerously unpredictable, but the waters here at Riversport Rapids, the most technically advanced rapid water facility in the world, are predictable and programmable, making these swift waters ideal for training. We can control the current, control the conditions to make the training most conducive for what we need it to be. There's very few of the facilities like this that allow this kind of training. I do think it's one of the best in the nation. Swift water holds a warning for us all. Number one thing I learned is not get in it if you don't have to. That's the number one thing. Try everything else. I mean, people die every year. Turn around, don't drown. Just don't cross any of the water. Even if you think you can see the ground, just turn around and find an alternate route home. <laughs>